Hello, Darth Vegan here, back with another Mount and Blade Warband mod. This time we are going to be playing L'Aigle, which is French for Eagle. Uh, we are going to be playing this mod for a little bit. Um, I, I jumped into it just very briefly and uh, had just had a little, little blast just uh, just in the first few minutes of the game. So we're gonna we're gonna play this for a little while. And um, maybe we can get a nice little series going. I don't know. But um, the year is 1809 and the Corsican born Napoleon Bonaparte sits on the throne of the French Empire. Napoleon's reign as ruler of France has been a period of almost perpetual war with some nation or another. And indeed, France now finds itself engulfed by bitter fighting in the Iberian Peninsula. Recognizing an opportunity to reclaim land and the status it lost in previous wars, Austria, though it has no sent no official declaration of war, launched armies at France's allies in Bavaria, Italy, and Poland. With Napoleon in Paris, command of the French forces in Bavaria has fallen on the shoulders of Marshal Berthier, Napoleon's chief of staff. Meanwhile, an alliance of Spain, Portugal, and Britain tries desperately to check France's advance into Portugal and southern Spain. Select my character's sex. Male, my father my father was a soldier. As a child, I was uh let's see. How about an engineer's apprentice? How about that? Uh as a young adult, I became a military student. And how about a lust for money and power. Become an adventurer and ride to my destiny. Allow me to quit without saving, of course. Why would I quit without saving? True guy, Larus. All right, and let's see what I've got in my uh, stats here. Let's get, uh, hmm, yes. Let's get me a little more intelligence as well. I get a little uh, prisoner management, some inventory management, um, pathfinding. Let's see what else we got. Some trainer already. Got riding good. Athletics? No, we don't have. Let's get one weapon master. One. Let's get a couple power strikes. All right, musketry. We're gonna need that. We'll also need pistols. I don't know what I start. What I tried it the uh, the other day. I started off with a little pistol, but I don't know if I chose the same. I already like this already. I like this guy. I want him. I like that hairstyle. With the lamb chops. Mmm. I'm thinking lamb chops. Thinking lamb chops. This may be my guy. This may be him. This is true Kyler Roos. He's a youngin. Okay. We are going to be fighting, uh, hopefully for London. For England, the United Kingdom, you, your coach entered London across the dirt-covered Kensington High Street. The sides of the road were lined mostly with gardens and country houses until you hit the bus busy market section of Pall Mall. From Pall Mall, you traveled through Charing Cross into the Whitehall. The east side of Whitehall was lined with governmental buildings, but the west side was mostly shops and run-down housing. You felt a little uneasy as you passed the notoriously crime-ridden Scotland Yard, known by all as a meeting place of thieves. You are exhausted by the time you find an inn in London, England. As you stumble sleepily towards the stairs in the bedroom floor, you pass by the bar and bump into a man. He's drunk and well-dressed and was about to put back another drink before you spilled it all over him. Indeed. Mm-hmm. You've spilled my drink, you rat! What have you to say for yourself? Well, I'd say I spared you further embarrassment, you tosspot. <laughs> nice tosspot. You blackguard! You rat! You dog! You'll pay for this, you will, and I'll guarantee that. I'll have satisfaction, by God, I will. Find yourself a second and meet me outside town tomorrow morning. My second will retrieve you shortly after dawn. Remember, he'll be under orders to pop you if he sees the authorities. A man in a black coat who's been standing in the shadows 
watching the events unfold, stepped towards you and offered his services as your second. You had little choice but to accept. He introduced himself as Fielding and said he could provide the necessary weapons. You went into your room, this time without ruining any drinks, <laughs> and attempted to sleep. Nervousness about the morning, however, you kept awake for most of the night. Shortly after dawn, Fielding and the other man's second arrived and took you to the meeting place. Your opponent has left it up to you to choose the manner of your duel. Will it be pistols or swords? I'm better with a sword. I hope you're good with a blade. The winner is the last one able to stand. Your opponent is a hot-headed sword and will be constantly on the offense. Use that to your advantage. Alright. Aha. You don't look like the guy I spilled the drink on. No, indeed. Aha. Aha. Perry. Come here. Yeah, you're not that tough. Oh, didn't expect that, did you? Aha! 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 Yee! Rake killed by True Colorus. I suppose that's the last frivolous duel he'll be fighting the fool. I must congratulate you on your victory. Perhaps you should go get some rest now. You've earned it. Victorious in your duel, you return to your inn and attempt to get some rest, putting the whole unfortunate matter behind you. When you awoke a few hours later, the duel seemed a distant memory and you had nearly pushed it from your mind when a knock came suddenly on your door. Greetings, I trust you've rested well. I slept fine. That's good to hear. You'll need your strength in a place like this. Anyway, I didn't come here to make small talk. No, I'm here to come clean with you. I wasn't merely a tavern drunk that nobody nobly offered his services. Truthfully, I am a customs inspector and I've been following the man you dueled for weeks. He's involved with a group of violent smugglers we've been trying to track down for months. I've been intending to arrest him. But when you bumped into him, I figured his death in a duel would accomplish the same thing, only without all the paperwork. What's your meaning telling me all of this? Well, you've proved yourself a useful sword and we need all the good men we can get. Now it's dangerous work, but it puts a little coin in your pocket. Danger? Money? Presumably women? Where do I sign up? <laughs> now that's what I like to hear. Anyway, our main impediment to eradicating these smugglers is our present difficulty in uncovering the location of their hiding place. None of my runners have succeeded in tracking them, and none we've captured have talked. There may be some luck in store for us yet, though. We've recently noticed a new greenhorn running with the group. If we're fortunate, he'll still be soft, and we'll be able to work the location out of him. He and a few of the other smugglers are presently working as duffers on the roads outside town and posing false contraband upon gullible bumpkins at inflated prices. If you can capture him and dispatch his accomplices, we may be able to extract from him the information we need. Gather some local men, if you have to, and look for them on the roads around town. I'll be waiting here for your report. Why send me? Aren't you and your men better suited to this? They have as many spies as we do, and they know us all as well as we know them. They won't recognize you, though. You'll be able to get by their lookouts without them bolting. Good luck, and try not to get killed. Okay. So here we are in jolly old England. Jolly old England. We've got a pretty nicely uh, sized map here. Quite a bit of Russia on the map, so that's cool. Um goes down to Greece. None of the uh, Middle East is populated, although the map is there, so maybe in a future update there'll be additional towns there. Surprisingly, none, no one in Spain, so that that's a surprise, considering that was part of the backstory. Um, but you got France here and uh, all of that. You get a little bit of Belgium, so that's cool. Who is this? Uh, that part of France? Yeah, La Empire. Okay. So, what we're going to do here is uh, we're going to try to get 
um, these duffers. <laughs> but I need to get me some troops first. I guess these are the duffers. Yes. Young smuggler and the highwayman. All right, so I need to get me some troops. Um, let's jump into England right quick. Welcome to Legla. To join a faction, seek out recruiters in capital cities, or if a faction does not possess a capital, military depots. Okay, great. Mm -hmm. Let's go ahead and go into the tavern. Maybe we can get some volunteers from around here. There's some volunteers. Uh, cutthroat tavern pat patron. Uh, I love this tavern. This is really nice. This is cool. Traveler. Tavern patron. Tavern keeper. Let's see what the tavern keeper has to say. Okay, he's got a job, so all right, good. I love I love this. Look at that. You can see out the windows. That's cool. Cutthroat, how much are you? Eee. Sorry. No, thank you. How about some volunteers. One man volunteers to follow you. I can recruit him as line infantry, light infantry, line cavalry, or light cavalry. Let's do line infantry. Alright. Let's get on out of here. Let's take a look at my inventory. What have I got? I do have a sea service pistol, some cartridges, a fancy dagger, a worn out hack, some fishies, an awesome trusty bicorn hat. I've got almost no money. All right, so let's take a look at these duffers here. Let's get them. Should I go ahead and attack them? I've got two guys. Where's he going? I'm going to go over and get some troops right quick. Recruit some more volunteers. No one is willing to join me. Of course they're not. There's a military depot in England. I don't have very much money anyway. You think we could two against four? Surely we can take these guys. Let's take them. Aha! Say, you look like a sly one. I've got top quality goods you can't get in stores. Okay. I've no interest in worn out shopkeepers. <laughs> ha! Let's see how well you can bully with a knife in your gullet. All right, let's get these guys. I have faith in me and my companion here. British recruit, you stand here. Oh, he's not an infantry. He is going to be a musketeer. Hold that position, musketeer. Yes, get ready for a battle. I'm going to ride down this path. See if we can find an enemy. Surely we shall defeat them. Is that them running down the road? Yes. Okay. Hopefully they don't have guns. That's my hope. Uh, I don't see any. Straight away. Woo! <laughs> he does have an axe and a pistol. Oh, he does have a gun. Oh, crap. Crapola. Musketeer, you get up here. I want this guy with the gun here. Ha ha! Ha ha! Bye bye, young smuggler! I beseech thee to surrender now! I beseech thee! Uh huh. Oh. This guy has a musket as well. Woo! Let's see what my old dagger can do. My trusty dagger. Oh! Pretty handy. Uh-huh. Don't you swing that axe at me. Don't you swing that axe at me. Alright. I feel pretty good about this. My musketeer is shooting off in the distance. Where do you think you're going? Ha ha! No, thank you. You shan't... Escape. Law and justice. Given by True Kyler Roos. I love his shirt. Okay. Don't kill me, sir. I swear I ain't so bad. I just fell in with a bad lot. I'll do whatever you want. I'll spare your life. But in exchange, I want information. You had better start by telling me where your smuggler pals are hiding out. Better make the information good, too. We won't be releasing you until we've found the spot. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I'll tell you where we hide out. I'll even show you. <laughs> oh, boy. A hunting musket. Interesting. Bit pistol cartridges. Can't be used on horseback. Iberian trousers. I got civilian breeches. 
Mm hmm. Got some stones. A ragged black bandana. Sure. I'll take all of this stuff. I got a hunting musket. No cartridges. Okay. Ranged 80. Accuracy 70. Okay. I may need that musket if I can. Uh, um, let's go see if we can find, get some more recruits here real quick before I head back to England. All right, recruit some more volunteers. No one is willing to follow me. Who's this guy? King George? Bye, George. We have it. Oh, my gosh. Where are all the freaking recruits? Let's go to Portsmouth. Who is this? Hi, women. Mm-hmm. Aha. Good. Good. Got four men following me now. It's good. Let's go to Canterbury. And recruits don't have enough money. Oh, I'm broke. All right, so I guess we better go sell this stuff and talk to our friend here in England. Uh oh, oh no, we'll be having your things, you speckle shirted dogs. I'm not afraid of you. I will fight. Five troops against their five. Well, aren't they special? Let's see what we got here. Ooh, it's a rainy day here in jolly old England. Let's get our guys set up here somewhere. Let's find a place to uh, call our defensive home. Here comes the old swags there. Scallywags. We'll just take Papa Squat here across the river. Alright. Come on, gentlemen. I don't think I can shoot from this far with this pistol. Uh, you want to move up a little bit? Jeez. Alright, guess not. Hi, guys. Hi. They don't even have weapons. Oh, crap. He's got a musket. Okay. Looks like these are the guys I want to shoot first. Oh! Oh! Get out of the water. Of course he's drowning. Run! Woo! That's scary. That musket. I don't like those musket guys. Alright. Get this guy with the musket. There we go. I feel much better. Let's get this guy as well. Oh! Horsey! A worn out hack. Alright. Don't you stab Lucifer! You scallywags! You toss pots! <laughs> Alright. I've got blood on my shirt. Alas. Okay. Got some pirates. Oh, look at this. A ragged, tarred straw hat. <laughs> Mm, too bad it's not better. I would totally wear that if it was better. Oh my gosh. That's <laughs> awesome. Okay. 20. Mm. Okay. We're good. Musket cartridges. Yay. All right. I'm thinking I might uh, might end up with the musket here. I'm not sure. I wouldn't be able to use it on horseback, but I could ride up. Shoot. Oh, I'm not going to get rid of this yet. But I will put it, uh, at least my musket. No, that's pistol. There's musket. Okay. Um, I will go ahead and put that in there like that. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. All right. Got some more pirates. Bunch of them. Thirteen. What do I got in my inventory here? And you do I got room for one more battle? I think I do. Let's uh, let's fell fell these other pirates here. Yeah. Charge them. We got these guys. I'm not scared of these guys. Hopefully, there's not a bunch of them with the uh, <laughs> with the best rifles this time. All right, guys, you know where to go. Right up here by the river, just like last time. Just like last time. I'm going to pop off of here. 
pop a squat. Oh crap, there are a bunch of them with muskets. Alright, how do you squat? Okay, there we go. Ooh. There we go. Let's get these guys. Wow. It's a long reload on this time. It's a bad boy. Alright. Reload. 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 Alright. <laughs> I'm gonna have to come over here and get these guys. Oh boy. Don't drown, Lucifer! Come on, Lucifer, get out of the water! Oh gosh, there's a bunch of them with muskets. Oh my gosh. That's scary. That is scary indeed. Uh-huh. Aha, come here. Come here. There we go. I want to get these guys with these muskets. Ah, get off of me. Brawlers. Oh boy. Come here. There we go. Alright. Ah! My backhanded swing leaves a little bit be desired there. There we go. Come on, guys! Take it easy on a chap, won't you? Oh! Oh my god! That was a terrible, terrible blow. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Back over here with my men. That musket shot almost took me out one shot. Oh my god, look at my bloody face. It must have grazed my head. Okay. Ooh. Scary. Men, I do require a bit of assistance. Does anyone have a tourniquet? Alright. Let's reload this puppy. Lucifer, you stay here. Lucifer. Good job. Baha. Come here. Yo, rat, come here. Fight me with your bare hands, you dirty pirates. There we go. Okay. That guy's running. I'll take care of him. You guys take those musketeers. I got this guy. He shan't escape justice. Or me. Well, yeah. He escaped me, but not justice. Lucifer. Wait right here, Lucifer. Alright. Time to get in line here with my men. Papa Squat. Mm-hmm. It's a bit smoky. I say. I dare say I can't see a thing. Wow, they were, <laughs> you have no idea where within that reticule where I'm gonna hit. Okay, guys, why don't you move up a little bit? Um single rank formation? No, that's not what I wanted. <gasps> oh no! I was knocked unconscious by a pirate. And okay. Pirate killed. I'm guessing they're just gonna sit here and duke it out. Maybe. Okay. Run on ahead, guys. Run on ahead. Kill these guys. You got it. I can't believe I got knocked unconscious. Poor True Kylie Roos. Hot bloody mess. Uh oh. One of my guys got shot. Charge, men! Charge! 
charge. I wish every mod had the uh, the same option as Medieval Conquest, where you continue fighting as one of your one of your followers. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Guess I'll just go ahead and retreat. Okay, you retreated from the fight. Order attack without me. Oh no! What? What? No! I should have just waited. Oh my god. Are you serious? I lost my British sailor Spencer. Oh my god. <sighs> Plus 21. Oh my god. Time to go back to the pistol. For sure. Alright. Good grief. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> let's uh let's go ahead and bump my strength up my agility up let's get my weapon master a little higher power strike can't go much higher weapon master can't let's get some athletics let's get a uh, little more one-handed weapons there we go all right let's get out of here let's go to nottingham see if we can pick up some guys do i have any money i got 24 francs Alright. Spit my 20 francs. Let's go back to London, England. In the United Kingdom. And hopefully we can uh, turn in this mission. Alright, let's go back to the tavern. Visit this guy. Brunswick Fulcia. Where is Fielding? There he is. My spies have reported on your success. Excellent work. I say you've earned a few coins. Now that we know where those bastards are hiding, I'll gather my officers and runners together for an attack. Let me know when you're ready to join us, and don't bother me until then. Hurry, though. They'll surely notice some of their men are missing before long. Alright. Uh, I reckon I probably need some money for that. Horse breeder, general merchant. Okay, he's got plenty of money, so I don't. So I'll be selling all of this stuff. Uh, okay. Maybe I should keep one of these hunting muskets. I don't know. Let's keep one. I don't know, that's most of my money. It's not that great anyway. Let's go ahead and sell it. I'll keep the cartridges. Okay. Let's take a look at the gunsmith. What he's got. An infantry rifle. Ooh, yes. See? That's what I need. Rifled carbine. Either one of those. Either one. Uh, preferably this one. And a saber. Yes. An EP. Mm-hmm. That's what I mean. Okay. Let's go find some volunteers. I should have looked in here first. Enlist some volunteers. Three men. Okay. I don't know how many men I need for this little job he wants to do. Let's see. Let's see here. Fielding. Ready to go. Let's join my men. Okay. Following the directions of the Greenhorn Smuggler, you find a small force of customs officers march toward the smuggler's den. All right. Let's go. Let's do this. Aha, I should have brought my musket. Oh, bah, yeah. These guys look s smart in their little brown pants and their sabers on their side. They're throwing rocks at us. Okay. Come on, Vildling. Let us go forth. Fielding's not scared. It's gonna run forward. Oh yeah! Take that, punk. Gotcha. Haha, -ha, I got your back, Fielding. Got your back. Alright. Pistol cartridges. Uh oh! Fielding went down. Guys, can you come up here? Will they follow me? 
We can shoot them from up here. Yes, come on up here. Right up here on the edge. Shoot down on our enemies. I love the sound of this pistol, man. Crazy. Oh, crap! There's someone on our flank. I'll get them. Oh, boy. I'll get these guys on our flank. I've got these men. Good job. Good job. Hey! Oh, there's only one left. Oh! I thought that was coming. I was scared. Who can reload first? Me! <laughs> Sucker. Okay. There's one guy over there on the rocks. He's down. Who's left? Oh, nobody. After the last of the smugglers have been cleared out, looting of the smuggled goods began en masse. Eventually, all were ordered to stop and some men were sent back to town for wagons. You and those that hadn't been ordered to remain as guards returned to town. All right. Did I get anything from that? Seriously? Fielding? Where's my payout for that? Risk my life. Ha ha! What a fight that was. We really showed those bastards, didn't we? I told you they wouldn't go unhanged, didn't I? Anyway, they commanded a considerable bounty, which I'll gladly share with you. With this business finally concluded, I suppose I'll move on to other work. Consider your debt to me repaid. Perhaps we'll meet again in the future. Until then, I bid thee farewell. Um, you, you're an odd man, though perhaps not an entirely unamusing one. Okay, well I guess that's about it for this first episode of Legla. I hope you enjoyed it. Let's take a look upstairs, just to make sure we don't miss something. Here we go. A pharaoh player. I don't want to play cards at the moment. Let's take a quick walk around the streets. Alright. Ooh, pretty ladies. With their funny hats. Look at this gorgeous town. Seriously. Well done. Well done. Well done indeed. What is this? Garbage in the streets? <laughs> Some little bottles? Okay. Piles of hay. Clothier. Alright, so if you guys leave me some likes, it seriously helps my video so much. So I'm asking, please, please give me some likes on this video. I hate begging, but uh, if, you, uh, if you want to see more, let me know in the comment section below, and I will continue this series. Otherwise, welcome to Legla, and adieu. Adieu, adieu.